To have one family member fighting cancer is difficult. To have three children fighting the same disease, that's unthinkable. All three boys in the Rush family are currently fighting bilateral retinoblastoma, and they hope their fight can help inspire more funding for research. Caitlin Ross joins us now with their story. Caitlin? All three Rush boys were diagnosed before they were six months old. This is a cancer that attacks very young children. Right now, in the United States, only 4% of cancer research funding is dedicated to childhood cancers. And the Rush family thinks that desperately needs to change. President Trump's administration promised an additional $50 million in funding to research childhood cancers, and really, that's what they have. Retinoblastoma is a cancer that exclusively attacks very young children under the age of three. Tristan, Kaysen, and Carter will all diagnosed before they turn six months. Carter just started his first round of chemotherapy last month, and the prognosis is good. In the 1970s, only about 50% of children diagnosed with cancer survived. Now that number is closer to 80%. The Rush family wants it to be 100%. People don't know how to treat children with cancer in terms of when you, know, when we, when you tell them you know, they're, they're sorry for you. Um, you know, and we appreciate that, but I think, you know, as any family say, you know, it's, it's something you don't want to go through, but these kids want to be treated like um, any other kid. They have started a fundraiser to help offset the cost of their treatment. We've linked to that on our website, 11alive.com.